Hey my babies, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Raya J and I'm back with another video. Today is Sunday and I'm cooking Sunday dinner. Well, I'm doing a lot. I'm cooking Sunday dinner. I'm taking out the baby's hair. Um, I'm about to eat me a salad because what I'm making tonight is going to take about two hours. It's gonna take a few hours to cook my meal. And it's me and Mookie's, me and Missouri, stop shaking the pot, it's me and Missouri's favorite meal. <laughs> and this is the only beef that we eat, which is oxtails. Um, we don't eat hamburger meat, we don't eat ribs anymore, we don't eat, um, we don't eat beef, you know. The most ganye we eat we is eat. turkey and chicken and we seafood. Eat, we don't eat crunchy bacon. Yeah, we don't eat pork. Um... So I just wanted to show you all how I make my food. So um, I'm making corn on the cob. I'm making homemade corn on the cob, homemade mashed potatoes, and homemade oxtails. So how I make my oxtails is I season them up, just like you season up your canne, and um, which up you know you can season it up to your liking. And then I use my browning seasoning. When I went shopping this morning, they didn't have my Jamaican browning seasoning, so I had to get. Let me show you the two that I got. I got this one, Kitchen Bouquet, and I got Gravy Master. So, and I even also used this one, <laughs> Maggie. So there's a lot of brown and season I use, but my favorite one is the Jamaican brown and season in a glass bottle. You can find that in a gym, like with the Jamaican products at your supermarket. So I just put my brown and seasoning in, and now I'm gonna show you it. I put it in the pot and I want it to brown, you know, although it has the brown and season, I like to just brown it a little bit. Um, so this is how it looks now. And I just, so now I'm gonna mix it up. And then when you season your, oh, and I have onions in my oxtails as well. Sometimes I put onions in, sometimes I don't. And please excuse this ugly ass pimple on my face saying, hey bitches, yeah, um, don't mind her. She's just trying to be a part of the party, and we're not going to let her steal a show today. No, we're not. So, also, I have, after I seasoned my oxtails in this bowl, shook it up and everything, this was the rest of the seasoning in the bowl. So, I just add water to this bowl, and um, after I, so now, uh-uh, stop. So, now, I'm going to mix... Now I'm going to stir my oxtails in the pot as it's browning and then I'm going to add my water with the rest of the seasoning that was inside the bowl that I, that I um, prepped my oxtails in and I'm just mixing it up. Different. Yeah. It looked, so it looked like a person's body. The other ones, the other bones. So yeah, when I bought these oxtails today, they had you know some supermarkets where they don't cut the oxtails in half, like it'd be humongous pieces that they trying to sell. I had them cut all my pieces in half, and that's how I came up with these pieces right here, because I don't eat no big ass oxtails like that, you know. Um. So these are brown and nice. I'm going to add my water now. And I'm going to show you all how it looks. Um, so yeah, I hope you all are doing well. Um, I hope you all are continuing to stay about happiness, peace, and love. And I hope you all are continuing to stay determined, motivated, and focused. Um, yeah, so this is perfect. So now I'm going to add my water to my oxtails and I'm going to basically let that broil for two hours on low more from low to medium heat but mostly low because I got as I, I always do this on Sunday I got a lot to do I got to do the baby's hair take we're going to finish taking the rest of her hair out and then I got to wash her hair and then I got to blow dry her hair then I got to do her hair so <laughs> within that process that takes me a few hours um so while i keep everything my oxtails my my um let me put this right here just here like this. i'm gonna show you all my salad too i made me a spinach salad so don't knock that down bad um i can no, just, I'm gonna do that. the salad 
I'm gonna show y'all my potatoes boiling as well. Um, I'm gonna show you right now. Right now, I'm pouring in the water into the oxtails. This is how I cook my oxtails. So now we turn that on low and you let that cook. So this is how my oxtails look now. And then I'm, I'm like I said, I'm gonna just let this all boil you for two hours or so i checked them i checked them in between me doing the baby's hair and stuff to make sure they're cooking you know to our liking um so yeah this is how it looks now so now you know as you can see my heat is on low um i have my corn in my pot i just put put my i peel my corn stop i don't want to drop my phone i peel my corn and then i um rinse my corn and then i put a little salt and butter in my water keep that water heat on low put my corn in and let that cook <laughs> as i said i like everything to be on low and just cook because i am really busy on sundays um on a normal day other than sunday i probably won't cook everything on low because i want to eat it but <laughs> on sundays that's definitely my go-to and then let me show you how i do my um my homemade mashed potatoes so this is my potatoes normally i've been doing red potatoes but today i was just you know i went shopping today and i got everything that we needed so i just got brown potatoes i mean red potatoes are more healthier than brown but it doesn't really matter you know so i got the brown potatoes today um so they're boiling slow as you can see i have that on low heat um, and I'm gonna let those potatoes get really soft and as I poke them with a fork or whatever um, And they're soft. I drain the water and then I'm gonna show you how I cook everything So the oxtails you already know season them up put the brown um, put the brown seasoning in them um, Cook them um, You know brown them up in the pot with your seasonings and stuff once you brown them and cook them a little bit, you know, for the outer layer of the oxtail, add your water, put it on low heat or whatever heat you want it on. Let it broil down. You might need to add some more water as it's cooking because I like my oxtails very soft. Um, very soft. Falling off the bone, baby. So, and then my corn too. I like my corn soft. So, as that cooks, you know, I check it and make sure it's to our liking and, and it's, you know, it's how we like it cooked. And then for the mashed potatoes, let me tell you what I do. I make sure that the potatoes are soft and I drain the water and then I'm gonna I don't really like to tell people my, my cooking recipes but I'm gonna share it with you all my babies I like to add mayonnaise I do like two to three spoons of mayonnaise after I mash them up with a fork like this you know mash them up mash your potatoes up then I like to put two spoons of butter I like to put about three to three three and a half spoons of mayonnaise then I like to put salt garlic pepper um, I like to put total, I like to put total pepper, I said garlic, salt, um, and basically mix that up, mix it up well, and you got mashed potatoes. Some people I know they use sour cream, some people use cream cheese. I just, my main two ingredients in my um, homemade mashed potatoes is mayonnaise and butter, and season it up how you like, baby. Woo, you done cooked yourself. <laughs> Ryan J's homemade mashed potatoes. So also, I made me a salad, so I'm about to eat that right now. Look, this is what I'm about to eat now that I got the food going. I got some spinach, avocado, and I got some cucumbers. So, mm. oh my gosh. As I, let me show you how I make my salad. <laughs> I put olive oil, a little bit of um, vinegar, Salt, pepper, garlic, pep, garlic powder, um, total, and I went a little different with this salad. I don't normally put lemon juice, but I did buy a small lemon oh, juice yeah. today when I went shopping. So I'm, I put well, Wookie squirted two squirts of lemon juice in, and then I put me some hot sauce. Shake that baby up, inshallah, and you got you a fresh salad. Um, so yeah, we gonna let everything cook on low. We're going to get up at this kitchen right now. Mama. Close the fridge. Close the fridge. You don't need lemon juice. So, yeah, that's what's going on today. I was supposed to do laundry today, but I'll do it tomorrow when the baby go to school. 
It was snowing this morning. Come on, Wookie. Change your movie. It was snowing this morning. Come on. It was snowing this morning. Um. So, you know, I didn't want to have the baby out in that weather and stuff and, you know, dragging her from here to here. So we just went shopping. Then we went to the breakfast spot by our house. They made us... Um, toasted cream cheese bagels and then I had a coffee a French vanilla coffee and the baby had apple juice those are our favorites um I've, I've been doing really good like I haven't had coffee in like months <laughs> like a few months I haven't had coffee but yesterday I bought um a cup of French vanilla and then today I bought a cup of French vanilla so it made me really good I mean a cup or two of coffee won't hurt right So right now she's about to put on another movie. Oh, 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 oh. And she taught it. She taught it. Oh, she taught it. Oh, she taught it. Oh. Um, I mean, as y'all can see, I'm ready digging into my salad. Get it, we gotta finish that hair. We don't wanna be doing that hair all night. Tomorrow's back to school. Mm. Oh, we did homework. And yesterday, yesterday I washed my hair and rebraided it. Y'all know how I do. I just keep my doodle braids in. <laughs> <laughs> and then um I took me a good bath I mean I'm feeling a little better I know y'all seen in my last content video y'all know I got my period so I'm feeling a little better Tylenol extra strength be my best friend While somebody was playing R. Kelly's music bumping out of their car, right? About an hour ago. I was like, please turn that off. I don't want to hear that music. Please. So finally, I think they drove away or whatever. And I was just like, thank you, Lord. I'm just so disgusted with that whole situation. And I really hope justice is served. I'm praying for the victims. So I got half of her hair to take out. Like I said, I'm going to wash it. Blow it out. That process is really quick, washing her hair. Blowing it out is actually quick. The long process for me is braiding it. She wants the same style. So the style she had was twisties all around. Basically, the, most of the hair was twisties. On the front, she had five braids coming like this. Like a bang. So. And now uh, Smallfoot. We're waiting for Smallfoot. We went to see it in the movies last year, but there's no small flood. We went to see it in the movie last year. So we waiting for it to come out on DVD. It should be coming out this year. Did y'all see it? Did you see it? Uh, I can't see it because it's small. Oh, that's <laughs> small flood. It's small. <laughs> well, I don't know if y'all can see that or not, but Small Foot the movie, y'all know that really good. Oh, this salad is so good. So I'm gonna eat this salad, do the baby's hair. And anyway, I just wanted to show y'all how I cook my infamous oxtails, homemade mashed potatoes, and corn. So. Thank you all for watching, my babies. I'll see you all in my next content video. Peace and love. Love you.